how engineers do it. Hello friends, welcome to another video on how engineers do it. And today I would like to show you something which I've come across a couple of days back. And uh, it's about formula suddenly not working in Excel. Uh, let's say for example, the next lookup is not working. Let me just demonstrate that to you. You can see that there's a value A, which I want to look up in this table of uh, five rows and two columns. Let's say that I'm just writing an X lookup here, which is X lookup. Look for this value, comma, going to the sheet, look up in this column and return the value in this column, right? So basically I need, I would expect that it would return 10 and it's going to return 10 the first time. Let me just show you what it is. It's returning 10, right? Now let me go back here and change the value as 15, right? If I change the value as 15, if I go back here, it's showing 10. So this is the kind of situation I had encountered a couple of days back and I was, uh, I was a little confused because I did not change any settings in Excel. Now this video is going to be helpful for you if you're also facing the same kind of problem, not specifically for XLOOKUP. XLOOKUP is an example because it's confusing because you might be referencing across sheets and it's really kind of difficult to identify what's really going on. Right now I'm just going to give you another example. Over here you can see A, B and A plus B. Now 5 plus 25, okay let me just uh, update this equals uh, this one plus this one, right? Now it's giving you 30, right? Now again if I change this to 30, now 30 plus 5 should be, should be 35, it's just giving you 30, right? Now the solution for this is really, really very simple. And I'm just going to, uh, in a while, I'm just going to tell you what it is. And also, I'll tell you why uh, or how did I encounter this and why this is kind of difficult for people to identify what's going on. Now, if you go to formulas, you have an option right here which talks about, uh, yeah, calculation option. Now, sometimes, now this is important, sometimes when you're working, I don't know why, it changes from automatic to manual. Now you just got to put that automatic and you can see it's updating, right? Now if I just change that to 15 from 15 to 20, now you can see that it's updating as 20 and if I change it to 35, it's changing it to 40. Now if you ask me why it's changing from automatic to manual, I have no idea. And this is why I had uh, I was uh, spending a little bit more time to identify what was going on and I thought it's a good idea to make a video on it uh, so that it'll be helpful for others too who's facing the same kind of problem. I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you so much and subscribe and stay tuned.